Insights Media. Two of the vehicles. There are norms. There are laws. This is not the first time that the governor of the state will give gifts to those who served in a particular government or even people that did not serve in that government. And I'll give you this. The current information uh, commissioner of Governor Deliki, by Sakola Kualimi. I succeeded him as the commissioner for local government and chief taxi affairs. When I got there, I didn't meet any official vehicle. And I knew that there was a brand new advances bought for him then as a commissioner. Where is that vehicle now? He went away with it. And he's the one that will come over the radio to defend the action of the government. Will the people of Oshino ask them, where is your own? Another one is my friend, uh, Babalawo. Be your donor. He went away with his own. Is in Adelike's government. And aside that, in the House of Assembly, we have some of them that served when Oyetola was, uh, was here. They got vehicles. They went away with the vehicles. They have not returned the vehicles. And I will tell you that Eden North is there. That's Koforola. Eden South is there. Oboku is there in the Kandu. And even Forum from Etigo, yeah. who is the chairman of the State Judicial Council Commission. He has a vehicle with him. So, Yoruba will say, Kini or Bofishi Ori. Tina Kiofishi. Eshe Wolashe. Even Adeleke himself, when he was a senator, when he was a senator, he was given a vehicle. Where are the vehicles? If he says, I return them, what happened? Then I must say this, the popular helicopter issue in the state of Osho. I remember one time, you journalists asked your social governor then, Governor Oyetola, where the helicopter was. And he said, with the, where they want to, it's where they want to get it repaired. I wonder, and at times I think, why is Governor Adeleke not asking for properties of the government, for those who served under Aregeshola. Why is he pursuing only those who served under Governor Yetola? Share hatred. He should go and ask Governor Aregeshola where the helicopter is. But because Governor Aregeshola was their partner, they did the election together, Aregeshola worked for PDP during the election. That is a compensation for him. They are compensating him. You see, double standard everywhere. Are we in the jungle? You hear some things about us, you think you are in comatose. That don't even know what is going on. Is this Nigeria? Is this part of Nigeria? No. So gentlemen of the press, we have a lot to say, even the issue of Obas. Look at the Alawo of Awo that my chairman mentioned in his uh, speech. Alawo of Awo. We made Alawo of Awo, we installed him as KBC. There was no case in court. After we installed him, there was a judgment from the court of appeal that he should not pronounce himself as Kabisi. And because of that, Governor Yetola received, refused to give a law of our staff of office till we left office. It was Governor Delegate's government that gave him staff of office, staff of office, despite the fact that there was a court judgment that says no. And aside that, to grant it all, the so-called Yeye Dupe and her husband went to Awo and became the Baba Bobaji and Yeye Bobaji of Awo, a, 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 a king, a Kabiesi, that the court said should not pronounce himself as the Allah of Awo. Look at the case of Alaberi. We installed Alaberi. We installed Alaberi on the October 20, uh, November 20, October 26th. Ballet two, three weeks to the end of our tenure. Alabere's name was mentioned among the 27 or 26 others that they said they were reviewing. Now Alabere is exonerated because Alabere is an offshoot of Eden. What are we talking about? What is the offense of Farm Odo? I just led a, I left a radio program where Kolaku Alimi said, how or not to somebody who just left as the chairman of a party come and become an Oba immediately. I said, yes, that was the offense of Famodou. Share hatred. 
share a trend. What they want is, they want to make sure that they silence everybody. And at this junction, I, I thank God I have this opportunity. I am calling on the following KBACs to come to the aid of Oshun and Yoruba land. First is the Oni of Ife, followed by the Owa of Ijesha, and the third one is Onogon of Ila. The Yoruba people that know the meaning of what I'm saying, they know how I arrange it, and they know the meaning of what I'm saying. They can join her now with the only one of Iwo, Ataoja of Oshobo, and Baba Watimi of Ede. That's what Governor Deleke is about to do. He's going to bring down the traditional institution in Oshun. Oshun is, is the heritage of the Yorubas, because that is where we have Ilefe. We don't joke with upper sheep in Oshun, for those who know it. <coughs> but because this government does not understand it, they think they can just do anything against upper sheep. I am calling on those others. Because what will happen is this. If, if at the end of the day, they say, yes, we remove this other, we remove this other. The uh, other ship has been politicized. Insights Media. Yeah.